Hey, what's up? I'm Nizio Cole, and welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to be talking about the differences and pros and cons between a reboot and a remaster for Watch Dogs 1. So first things first, we need to define what a reboot and a remaster is. I did a video earlier this week talking about my story concept for reboot. You don't have to watch that video to understand this one, but it would make sense to watch that one first. So I'll put that up on the screen in, in the description if you wanna go check that out. But for this video, a reboot would be a complete reboot of the series. So that would be retconning all of the previous Watch Dogs lore starting from zero. And it could either start with a completely different storyline, or it could be a deviation or a separate universe of the first game. Some of the other requirements for a reboot would be better mechanics, so a complete rethinking of the hacking mechanics and all of the other things that go along with that, better graphics, and a different story even if that story is a slightly altered version of the original Watch Dogs 1 story. Now, a remaster, as defined for this video, would be basically just Watch Dogs 1, but with better graphics and most likely with all of the E3 features. One of the reasons I tend to prefer a reboot is I feel like there's just been a lot of damage done to the Watch Dogs franchise with Legion, um, and you know even going back to the original Watch Dogs 1, e3 controversy and i think a reboot would be a good chance for ubisoft to right some of the wrongs that they've done and also get a new and unique watchdog storyline now going over to remaster i think a remaster would be kind of cool as far as getting the original e3 graphics that we've always wanted it has been almost 10 years since the original release of watchdogs 1 and the timing would make sense for a remaster people don't think that watchdogs is a huge game but i i still feel like watchdogs especially the community is pretty big the amount of people that bought the first two games especially is quite large so if they came out with a remaster and they didn't lie and and it was exactly how it was in the trailers. I think that would be interesting, but I, I don't think it would be the best for the series. I get a lot of comments talking about uh, if they should do a remaster. And, you know, I think remasters are cool, but also I kind of want a new story and I want an individualized story. So what I mean by that is I, I don't want something like Legion where it's like you're playing as all these different people. I'm fine with playing as multiple people. I think that could be a cool mechanic in a future Watch Dogs game but not so procedural that you're you're playing as all the NPCs. It's a cool concept, but I just don't think it was really the right choice for story reasons. Legion didn't have the worst story of any game that I've played, but it definitely was the worst out of the three Watch Dogs games that I feel. And I'm just kind of looking for something new. I think a reboot or alternate universe of the original Watch Dogs game would probably be the best outcome, like I said in my other video. But yeah, so those are my thoughts on the Watch Dogs reboot versus remaster debate. Hope you all enjoyed this video. Let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below. Would you prefer a reboot for the Watch Dogs series or a remaster of Watch Dogs 1? So yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this video. And I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.